Oh god, here comes another jump. Speed! We need more speed. I was doing a little bit of swerving. Oh! My How's it going everybody? Dragast here and welcome back to some more Just Cause 3. So last episode we did an Easter egg episode and you guys seem to really really enjoy that. So I'm going to do another one here because there's a lot of great Easter eggs in this game that I would love to show to you guys. Uh, so yeah, there's a bunch of different ones I'm going to do today and uh, yeah, we're going to check them out and I will show you guys where they are. So if you do want to play with them in your own personal games, that's totally fine as well. We're actually headed to the first one right now on this small little lake. Okay, I don't think I'm going to be able to land this thing. You know what? We can try and land it, though, because I do like this plane. I actually just randomly spawned into the game with this plane. Now, I wonder if I can kind of land it in this field over here. I doubt it's going to happen. Let's turn off those engines. Oh, man, this game is just so freaking beautiful. And I'm going to do it in 60 FPS today just to try it out. Uh, see what you guys think of it. Look at this. I actually kind of did land it. I don't think I... Okay, I still got my propellers and everything. But yes, plain aside, what we want is actually over here on the other side of this lake. So let's actually try and head over here and, uh, yeah, see what it's all about. Okay, somewhere over here is something very cool. We sh probably should be seeing them pretty damn soon, unless I put the coordinates in the wrong place. There they are! Look at that, right on top of where I was. Now this is... A yellow duck boat. Yes, we got yellow duck boats in the game. So these are, uh, this is the only place they spawn. You actually gotta kind of drag them over here. So let's see if we can do this. Uh, and then we're gonna drive it and have some fun. Okay, duck boat. Get into the water. <laughs> get this. There's no other way to do this. This is a brilliant idea. Uh, is that, is that enough? I don't think so. I think we gotta go a little deeper here. Okay, there we go. Yes, we have a freaking duck boat. Now, I'm pretty sure you can get on it, yes, <laughs> and drive it. This is, oh my god, why is it spinning so much? Okay, I'm trying to get into the deeper water, but clearly <laughs> this thing likes to spin. Jesus, can I please go straight? Okay, now I've gotten the hang of it. Holy shit, this is a really fast duck. Uh, unfortunately, we're only on a lake here, so we're not seeing any real waves. I wonder if I can attach this to my plane and bring it to the actual ocean. That was a beautiful bird, by the way. Because don't get me wrong, lakes are great, but if we can get some waves with this thing, I think it'd be really fun to try and drive. Now, my plane is somewhere up here. I'm gonna have to find it unless it despawn. That would really suck. Okay, Baywatch style, straight up on the land. Fucking majestic. Look at that. Yes. Now all we need to do is find my plane. Oh, it actually is still there. I'm actually really impressed. Okay, so now I just gotta figure out how I'm gonna bring the damn duck all the way up here. Honestly, the only real way I can do it is by using my grapples. So this is gonna take me a while. I gotta go basically up a mountain with this damn duck. Whoa, 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 what the fuck is going on here? Uh, did I just witness that? Is he just randomly shooting in the forest? He is an enemy. Did he just die? What the? Oh, there, there's someone fighting up there. I didn't even see him, but he got knocked the fuck out. Don't mind me just pulling a duck through a jungle war zone. <laughs> like, look at, there's so many people in here. I didn't even notice them. They're just fighting on this mountain. Oh. No! Oh my god, it's gonna fucking explode! Are you kidding me? Yeah, it's done. It is totally done. I oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, well that plan freaking failed. Let's go and get the other one duck that we have. We have one more chance to bring the damn ducks to the ocean. Oh, never mind. The other one respawned. So we have at least unlimited tries. That means I'm going to get it to the ocean. I'm actually gonna use a rebel drop here to get a helicopter. I think it'd be a bit easier. Okay, now that we got a beautiful little helicopter over here, it should be a hell of a lot easier. You know what? Let's take two, just in case. Now, I'm going to put one in the back and one in the front to keep the weight even, you know? Because we might actually have a hard time here. Holy crap, it's dragging it. Oh, that's because I'm trying to run. I'm an idiot. Okay, and one more somewhere in the front. That looks good. Let's hop inside and take these things to the ocean where they belong. Oh man, oh, why am I having such a hard time to bring this thing up? Oh god. Oh, does this is this really gonna knock me over? 
This is gonna be a harder flight than I expected. Oh shit, 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 no, 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 no. Okay, you know what? We probably only should've took one. <laughs> man down, man down. <laughs> God damn it, ducks, I just wanted you to be free. You know what? Okay, let's actually drop this down if we can before I crash it and burn it. I'm just gonna land it here. We're gonna drop one of these ducks and put one right in the middle. Okay, that should be much better, I'm hoping anyways. God, maybe I should have got a bigger helicopter. I got the smallest helicopter too. I didn't think this one through. Okay, this is seeming a little bit better. I can actually kind of control it. Uh, with, with two ducks, it was damn near impossible. I almost killed myself. By the way, if you were curious where these were, it's on Valdemar, right on this little lake here. Now, we got a long ways to go till we get to the ocean here, so I guess we'll just head over here. Actually, you know what? Let's go in this little bay here because this is our territory. That way I don't have any issues with enemies. So, so far so good. We are actually almost there and I haven't killed myself yet. There's definitely a big weight shift when you're carrying a ducky around. But as long as you go in a straight line with a helicopter, you're pretty much okay. Uh, the hard part is going to be putting this into the water without blowing it and my helicopter up. Oh my god, I have such a fear of heights right now. This game is doing really good at showcasing how high we are up. So we gotta actually start going down now. Um, I can't unfortunately really, oh there we go, we can kinda see my duck. So it is okay, but uh, it, it keeps going out of frame and I can't get it back into frame, so I can't really control this too well. Whoa, what the fuck just happened? I must have been going down way too quickly. Fortunately, my duck is currently okay. All right, get the hell out of this thing and get into the duck before we do any more damage. A moment of silence for helicopter. <laughs> you did a good job, buddy. But that's all we needed it for was to get it here. Oh, hey, sea dude guy, how's it going? I'm gonna race you. Oh crap, this thing is, I, I forgot how hard this thing is to turn. Goddamn ducks don't make good boats. Gotta be honest, all that effort to get it into the ocean, Probably not worth it. I mean, the only difference is it's a little more wavy, but this duck sure is happy, that's for sure. Oh my god, speedboats! Look at this! What is this, a speedboat gang or something? I really want to run one over. God damn it, I missed it. Here comes the sea dew guy again. He's way faster than me. Clearly, ducks are not the fastest things around. Then again, I am keeping up with the speedboat crew, so that's kind of nice. Okay, well that is the duck easter egg, guys. I think that's enough of this one. I spent a long time bringing this duck to the ocean. I hope he enjoys it here at least. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, the next easter egg that I'm really excited about is in the mountains of Grand Pasteur, right at the top of the map. On this little road here, there is actually a little soapbox car. Now this thing looks so damn fun. And what's cool about this easter egg is there's actually a challenge with it. So let's get in this thing and try not to kill ourselves. Oh my god, this this big head mode just adds so much to this. Now this is an unpowered car, so you kinda gotta just turn it to get it set up here. Okay, you know what, this is taking way too long. Let's just, let's do it the quick way. Bam. Bam. Okay, there we go. Oh shit, slow down. <laughs> Okay, now this thing should be set up to go. Whoa, holy shit! Uh, yep, there we go. Now we just gotta turn a bit. And this has no engine or anything, obviously. I'm, I'm, I'm sure you guys can tell that. It's all based on downhill. So we gotta get as far as we can with this thing. It's got, it's got a handbrake, and that's it. Okay, Endless Runner, travel as far as you can in the soapbox car. Now this track actually looks really good. I hope I don't kill myself here. Man, I wish I had a track like this when I was a kid. Actually, now that I think about it, I probably don't wish I had it like this because I would kill myself. Uh, we're almost at a thousand meters already, so not too bad. Oh god, now we're just going right down to the coast. It's getting really steep. Um, I'm, I'm worried about jumps now. Oh yeah, that's, that, that's looking like I could probably get air off it. Oh my god, okay, that is definitely a jump. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> this is so cool. Oh my god, there's brake noises. Come on, it's a soapbox car. Oh my god, I can't believe I made that jump though. And we're just, this is one of the coolest tracks ever. I would love to come up here with a really nice rally car and try and go up this track. Oh god, here comes another jump. Speed, we need more speed. I was doing a little bit of swerving. Oh my god, are we gonna make it? Oh, it's gonna be a rocky hit. No! <laughs> 
<laughs> went into the forest. But we're totally fine. Let's see if we can get back on track here. Oh yeah, we we got this. No problem at all. Just 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 a little headache. That's all. I think this is actually the end right here. That's no fun. I, I wanted more of that. That was my favorite Easter egg yet. Oh my god. Okay, some car just hit me. What an asshole. Okay, guys, seriously, you hit me. I didn't hit you. Are you serious? I'm a, I'm a guy enjoying his soapbox car. Can I get a fucking break here? Okay, guys, well, the enemies kind of ruined that for me. But, yeah, that was the soapbox car. Gotta say that was my favorite one yet. I love having challenges, and uh, that course was really freaking fun. Okay, we're in Grand Pastura again for the next Easter egg. It's right on the southernmost side here, kind of in this little triangle. If you go over... Here, you'll see a very big crater. Now, what could possibly have made this crater? It's probably not what you expected. We got Thor's hammer over here. Now, I don't know if you could pick it up or anything, but I'm really going to try here and see if I can grab this thing. Uh, it's not letting me pick it up or anything, but can I maybe attach this to it? Pull it off? I know it's not going to happen. It's Thor's hammer. It doesn't work that way, but at least we can try. Yeah, that, that broke it. Let, let's just try two, just in case. Okay, two, and yeah, Thor's hammer's definitely not moving. But just in case it does, let's do one more thing here. Okay, there's the hammer, and there is some nades. Doesn't do anything, so yeah, it's just totally visual, but I, th I really like the idea of adding Thor's hammer. And the addition to a big-ass crater because of it, brilliant idea. So yeah, guys, there's another three crazy Easter eggs for you to enjoy. Uh, let me know what you guys think of this. We can probably do one one or two more episodes with the current amount of Easter eggs found in the game. Uh, I really enjoy looking for them because it's so damn fun to play around with them. But uh, ultimately, it's up to you guys if you guys prefer this over the funny moments or if you want me to go back to the funny moments. Regardless, thanks so much for your support, guys. Thanks for watching and liking, and I will see you in the next one.